yeah i got it i got it hello everybody and welcome to brand new video in today's video i'm gonna be sharing with you how to install android 11 in your android in any android phone without pc without twrp without root yeah that's it man I'm gonna install today on your android android 11 without pc without twrp without root so before I start the video just gonna ask you if you would like to install android 10 as well i'm gonna leave a car up here you can watch the video how to install android 10 in any android without pc as well and without road and if you're not subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel hit the bell icon to get notified that when i upload a new video like the video and let's get started <laughs> What I need to do is just, I'm going to show you first of all, I'm going to show you that I'm using Android 9 here, my phone is Android 9, okay, Android 9 PM, I'm going here, as you can see, the system is really different with Android 11, so I'm going here on, okay, it's so on about phone, then I'm going to type here, and then I'm going to click here on this option, alright, as you can see, Android 9, I'm using Android 9 perfect then i'm going to show you that my phone has not root aces easily i'm gonna show you that my phone has not rooted has not root aces and i'm going to click on sh root checker to see if this has root or not okay as you can see my phone is S s4 kiosera okay i'm going to click on verify root as you can see root aces is not proper to of my device that means that my phone has not rooted then let's get started you have to download this zip file from the link that I'm going to leave on the description and download this ZAR Shiva to use on this tutorial. You need to download them. So as you can see, you have to download this application here, Android R11. Okay, now I mean, it's not an application, it's a, it's a zip file. So you have to, to download as well the ZAR Shiva to use it. So open it. So click it right over here to oh, extract, extract here. So wait to this extraction, all right? So you're gonna just open it. If you have another, if you have another application to extract it, you can use it, no problem. But I'm using here the Zar Shiva, it's the most easier ever. So then you're gonna click the first of all, you're gonna click this application, the last one, to install R11 APK. Click it out over here to install, install it, click to install right once you install it the error 11 don't open it just click on done then go back and install the first the first option now say cpl click right over here to install it click in, on install just wait and click and done as well okay then let's keep going here Let the next step is click on the pixel icon pack install it then you're gonna click to install Right away here and so just wait click on done then go back and the last one power shady click on it and the install click on install click on done perfect let's return here let's return then now the first thing that we have to do is click on android r so guys i'm gonna give you one advice don't jump in the video during the video i'm gonna show you that i'm gonna give you some tips to let this android run in your phone perfectly so don't jump the video stay on the video to, till the end and you're gonna have your android 11 already to use without harming your device and without pc all right guys let's click on android r then you're gonna click on this icon here the start icon then click it out over there and as you can see it's change it okay let's go to the step two as you can see my android is kind of different now so now it's time to click on this application cpl that we already installed it before click it out over here then now you're gonna press it and hold press and hold it. then you're gonna click on icon pack right away here click on it then you're gonna click on the first the second option i mean the second option here fix icon pack okay so let's wait to apply perfect it's applied as you can see that it's changed it is now pretty cool pretty easy 
pretty nice and don't worry about the virus this application doesn't have any virus so then now it's time to change the this okay it's time to change it we are going to click empower shady this right over here then you're gonna click on here to enable it click on it then you're gonna give it the permission here on right okay then click on this option then return then you're gonna click on draw as well to allow as well click on it then you're gonna click on notifications all right then you're gonna look for the power shady right, right over here then you're gonna allow it as well perfect once we did this you wanna go in accessibility click on it then look for the power shady and give the permission here and click ok perfect guys so let's return now so we are almost there we are, we are almost to have android 11 rooted as, as you can see guys my android is really 11 if you see everything is working fine everything is working perfectly so easily you can use it as you can see everything is working perfectly you know it changed the so now I'm going to show you that my phone is now Android 11. Before it was Android, it was Android 9, and now it is Android 11. I'm going to show you that by clicking on the setting. All right, okay. Now I'm going to, as you can see, it's really changed. It, it wasn't like this before. So now it's time to click on System. Then we are going to click on About Phone. All right. Then now it's time to click on, as you can see, my phone is really here, Kyocera. It's Kyocera 11, Android 11. I'm going to click here, type here, to show you that it's really Android 11, guys. So, I think that you'd like it and you enjoy it. So, if you really enjoy it and like it, the video, subscribe, leave it a like, leave a like, it's important. Comment there, if you have any doubts, comment there and I will let and I will try to help you a lot. Okay, guys. So, thank you for watching the video and see you on the next one.